More than half of the world's production of sunflower oil is made from flowers grown in Ukraine and Russia. The conflict has hit supplies hard. Whether it's French fries, stir fry or curry on the menu, the financial shock from the war is being felt keenly in the kitchen as cooking oil prices hit record highs. So obviously with the increase of the oil price, it's increased our cost quite a lot. So it's gone up 200, 300%, which is a significant increase. The costs of producing this food have skyrocketed. In London, buyers have also been limited to two drums of sunflower oil each. The oil is the core part of the cooking, like the initial first step. So the price increase has been from originally like for 20 litres, it was around 20 pounds, and now we're seeing around 60 pounds in some places. The shortage of sunflower oil has pushed up the price of other vegetable oils around the globe. Soya, rapeseed and palm have all reached recent price highs. That was already the case before the war in Ukraine. After COVID, we saw supercharged demand coupled with rusty supply chains. There was also some extreme weather conditions. Now with the war in Ukraine as well, we're seeing those commodity prices push even higher and it's affecting countries all around the world. The war has trapped millions of tons of sunflower oil earmarked for European buyers in Ukraine, causing a major supply shock that could last as long as the conflict continues. Now, the little bit of sunflower that's left in the system is going to run out in the next few weeks. The problem is there's, you know, we don't know how much and how long. So the, the ramifications of sunflower could go well into 2023, depending on uh, the situation in the coming months. Traders forced to look to other markets for solutions, hopeful that crop yields in countries like Romania could alleviate pressure on the demand when sunflowers are harvested later this year. Luke Hanrahan, Euronews, London.